Alright, so in today's video we are going to just kind of cover our neuter noun endings. Now for some of you guys you may be able to just breeze through this and take care of it with the book, but for others you want to have kind of a guided practice going through this. So let's go through this right now. So you should be, when you're <coughs> watching this video, you should have your case ending chart for nouns and adjectives in front of you. And we are going to be filling out the third column right here, and then the fifth column right here. All right, so that's second declension neuters, third declension neuters. So the, remember, the neuter noun rule is that the nominative and the accusatives look the same. Um, but before we get to that, let's just fill out what we already know on that chart. So uh, what are our second declension masculine endings? Bus, and don't forget also, R, E, good, O, um, O, Let's do the plurals now. E, or nice, ees, os, ees. Excellent. Let's jump over to the third declension. Nominative is dash, genitive ees, dative e, accusative m, excellent, ablative e, plurals, ace, um, ebus, Ace, and then a final, Ebus. All right, so let's fill out our neuters. Let's go back now to the second declension neuters and fill those out. So you should remember words like templum and idificium um, and uh, our, our second declension neuters. Um, so what are we guessing for our nominative singular ending? Right, it's an um. And since this is a neuter, the accusative is going to look the same, so we should expect another um. Excellent. The rest of the chart's easy. It just repeats the same genitive, the same dative, the same ablative. So um, e, o, um, o. All right, let's jump to the plurals. Now, this was the, the plurals for the neuters were a little different. What do you have for the nominative plural? That's right, it's an A. Not to be confused with the first declension. That's a whole separate A system. So if this is an A, that means this is an A as well. But then the rest are the same. Orum, is, orum. Oh, sorry, is again, not orum again. So total chart, um, e, o, um, o, a, orum, is, a, is. So really, you only have a couple of new endings to learn. Everything else is the same. All right, so let's go over to this third declension neuters and fill those up. So remember words like litus are neuter and flumen are neuter and animal actually happens to be neuter as well. Um, so what's our guess for the, the nominative for the new third declension neuters? It's going to be another dash. And that means that our accusative also has to be a dash. But just like in the second declension, these endings get repeated. So we have an ease again, we have an e, we have an a. We move to our plurals. What's our nominative, nominative plural for the neuters? You're right, it's the a. Then we repeat the genitive. So um, ibus, and ibus again. So our whole chart, dash, ease, e, dash, a, a, um, ibus, a, ibus. And that's it. Those are your neuter endings. So now, at, by this point in time, you should have these columns all filled out. All right? So you should have them and use them as a reference for, in class. Um, next, we're going to be working with uh, the fourth and fifth declension.